from 1680 Chinese shopping app to Amazon Direct, a step-by-step app yes, installation okay. and general review on how you can import from China to Amazon, a step-by-step -step tutorial with 1688. So let's go. But before we dive into the tutorial, as you know, my name is Rafi Yaku. I'm an importer and a procurement agent. If you want me to procure link on 1688, Tower, or Pindulu, or Fish, or you want me to pay your Chinese supplier, or you want me to coach you step-by-step -step on how you can be a procurement agent, consider to contact me on WhatsApp with the number in the description of this video. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, turn on the notification bell for more importation business tutorial like this. So with that being said, let's get started. Welcome back friends. So let's see how to do 1688 to Amazon directly without any stress. A step-by-step -step tutorial and general review about the app. Okay, so the very first thing you need to do is to make sure you open up your Google Chrome browser. Then you have to come to the address bar right here and make sure you type in 1688.com. Then when you type in stated.com, it takes you to the official page of 1688. Next thing you need to do is to make sure you translate from Chinese to English language. So for you to do that, you just have to head over to the top right here. You see the trans translate this page, click on that. Then you can translate to whatever language of your choice. Okay, so having done that, the next thing you want to do is to make sure you pay attention to a kind of uh, pop-up notification that will come on your browser, just like what you see right here. So we can read this thing now because we are able to translate to English language. So you can translate to whatever language you've spoken, so you'll be able to understand what is written right here. Now, this is where we get started with 68 direct to Amazon app installation and general view so what you want to do right here is to make sure you click on click to install then you take it to this particular new page right here so what you need to do right here is to also translate this into english language just come to the top right here and then make sure you click on english then it automatically convert all this page from chinese character into english language just like what you see right here then we can simply scroll down and then read some of the information right here so what we can do here is that so you can see compare price for the same style and quick finding the most matching high quality supplier on 1688 fast message delivery get reply messages from 1688 merchants as soon as possible more trading tools will be launched one after another so stay tuned so this is just a new uh, update as far as 1688 to amazon direct is concerned so you can simply scroll down and see the browser compatibility for this particular update then next thing you want to do is to choose any of the web browser that you are using so as for me i'm using chrome browser so what i need to do is to just click on local installation right here under the chrome browser local installation then it prepare the file and take me to another page so you just need to exercise a little bit patience and allow it to download successful now we have it download successful next thing we want to do is to exit from the web browser right here and we head over to our download folder on our pc so let's check it out so i'm going to minimize this page so i have the zip extension right here next thing i'm going to do is to press ctrl c to copy this file extension then i have to minimize then i will have to go to my 1685 from my desktop right here i will right click again i will make sure i look for paste just to paste the folder here now the next thing i'm going to do is to unzip this folder so for us to do that we just need to right click on the folder then we make sure we click on extract here all right so you have all the elements in the zip folder right here so the next thing i'm going to do is to make sure i locate this particular file right here so locate manifest so next thing you want to do is to press enter key on your keyboard then the manifest file is going to open up just like what you see right here next thing i'm going to do is to simply scroll down and uh, read the manifest detail so right here we have amazon china so we want to click, what we want to do here is to make sure we click on www.amazon.cn so click on that Then it open up into this page okay so you can simply go to the url right here so you can see the url okay if you don't want to go through all the rigorous process 
all right so at this point here we need to make sure we scan this QR code and have the app on our android phone so for us to do that it's just a simple thing so what i'm going to do next is to head over to my phone so right here on my phone i need to make sure i locate my phone camera okay so for android user Alright, so this is my phone camera right here. I'm going to make sure I click on it. Then the next thing you want to do is to make sure you click on the setting icon right here. Then make sure you scroll down and enable your scan key hard code. Make sure this is turned on. Alright, next thing you want to do is to click on here to go back to the camera. Then we have to position the camera into the QR code. Okay, it has recognized the QR code. Then we just tap on it. Then it takes us to this particular page. Next thing we want to do is to make sure we click on here to get the half. Then the next thing we want to do here is to make sure we click on download anyway. Then you can see our file downloading is being prepared. Okay, it's just a small file as you can see right here. So after a successful download, you can exit from the download page. So we have to head over to our so after a successful download, we need to head over to our file manager. So I'm going to click on here to check on my file manager. Then I will make sure I click on files. Then I will make sure I click, I go to downloads. Then I have the app right here. So next thing I'm going to do is to click on here to click on the app for installation. Then click on install. After a successful installation, we can access from our download folder. Then we go to the full screen and look for the app icon. Here we go. So this is the app right here. So this is the app. So I'm going to click on it. Just to launch the app. Now for us to launch this app, we need to accept the terms and conditions of using this app. So for us to do that, we just need to click on here, click on here to check on those two dots. So I'm going to click on this and this. Then in the, finally, I will make sure I click on here to, to register with the app. Alright, so we have the hub open up successful, just like what you see on the screen right here. So these are the affiliate company, such as you can see them on the screen right here. Now, one good thing about this hub is that whatever you purchase from here is an English and uh, is whatever you purchase from here is for global fashion. Okay, it's not for Chinese standard. Let's, for instance, we want to select any of the product right here, most especially if it is a gadget. Okay. Now let's search for a phone. So I'm going to come to the top right here and make use of this search icon. Then I'll search for Android phone. Then click on search. All right, so we have a lot of Android phones right here. So, so we can simply click on this Samsung right here. So let's check it out. Samsung. All right, so we have it right here. So we can simply scroll and see more picture of the product now a very great deal about this particular item is that you can see the item description here was written in english language so this is because this item is basically made for global fashion it's not for chinese so you can simply scroll down though some of the item description here might still be written in chinese but nevertheless you still have description in english language so this will tell you that this item is 
what in uh, so this will tell you that this item is for global fashion okay it's not for chinese fashion so you can simply scroll down and see more information about the item so this phone here costs about 1307 yuan so you can simply go back and look for another product so take a look at this one right here blue blue g63 so let's check it out so 2023 so from product display here you can see youtube you can see google play store which is very much important for every global fashion of phone so when whenever you see google play store on a phone like this so it simply means that any country outside china can simply use the particular item so let's swipe and see more product picture so you can see it right here okay you can see the display you can simply scroll down and see more detail about the items as far as this item is concerned and this item here is about 757.99 yuan so you can see the product detail so in my future tutorial i'm going to make a lot of video about this particular hub how you register and how to shop on this particular hub from china direct to amazon a step by step tutorial i hope you really got value for this video if you find this video useful give this video a big like and also remember to subscribe to the channel for more tutorial about importation of business thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you in my next video bye for now